Aloy! Oh, your timing couldn't be better. Over here! Aloy! Oh, this is a grand day. Greatness is in the air. Or will be soon. Greatness, huh? Behold, I call it Morlin's Amazing Elevating Orb, inspired by the floating spheres the Banuk use for their clan contests. When aloft, this grand construction will be a spectacle henceforth unseen by the eyes of the living. Unburdened by gravity, it'll be a floating beacon, drawing people from great distances to our destination of wonders and amusement. Except... We're missing one key piece. A mechanical burner. Small, magnificent design. Old world ingenuity at its peak. We found it when we opened up more of the ruins below and discovered numerous statues of strange winged serpents. One such statue had the burner in its mouth. Oh, no doubt part of some ancient fire-filled spectacle. Oh, Aloy. It's perfect for the orb. But a swarm of burrowers chased us out before I could grab it. Could you get it? Please? Okay, Moreland, you got me. I'm curious. I'll get it for you. <laughs> I knew I could count on you. Okay. Okay, head down to where we fought that Tide Ripper after you drained all the water. When you get down there, head right and look for a room to the side. The statue you want is up high, looming like a nightmare. Oh, and if you'd like a smoother descent into the ruins, use the elevator. Just head back into the building and go upstairs. Got it. I'll see what I can do. Stupendous. Thank you. I await your return. <laughs> I don't have to swim down. For anything now. This looks like the place. 
No burrowers, though. And that must be the statue. Okay, I gotta find a way up there. A vent. There's a crate in that room. But how to get to it? This could be useful. to reach the statue. It is hot.
Now to get the burner. Uh, huh. Made it. Whoa! Well, I got the burner. Better take it back to Moreland. <laughs> burner was. Might have been the ones that attacked Moreland. You're back! Did you get it? Do you have the device? Oh, please say you do. Oh, we're so close to something truly just majestic. Here you go, Moreland. Yes! Yes! Thank you. I hope getting it wasn't too much trouble. Oh, this design, it's so compact. Oh, the ancients knew how to make them. It should fit the housing like a dream. Just need to cinch up the blaze leads and away we go. Uh, we? Make the maiden flight without the maiden who played such a vital part? My mother raised me better than that. You should have the honor of seeing the world in a way that no one alive has ever seen it. How about it? How can I say no to that? that nah nothing to worry about we have a sturdy tether connecting us to the ground pure osirum craftsmanship well time to give it a little flame aha we ascend behold the world beneath our feet ah the sky at our fingertips the burner heats the air inside which gets lighter than what surrounds it so we rise Indeed, we're powered by hot air. Just like Stemmer. <laughs> but don't tell me I said that. We are on the cusp of history. The first successful Osirum flight. There have been other attempts? Oh yeah! The history of Osirum flights is fascinating. And 
you know, violence and frequently it's in the area. I feel like you should have mentioned this before. Nah, the others failed because their machines were too heavy and complex. They were begging to crash. Not here. Just a pilot compartment, blaze, a burner, the orb, and a tether. Within simplicity, there is perfection. Well, at least, you know, less chance of exploding. <laughs> you know, if Abaddon were here, he'd be drunk like a wastrel, crippling fear of heights. That said, he gets poetic when drunk. He has provocative rhymes about all his various ledgers. A little known fact, Osram poetry started as work songs and forges around the claim. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Just a bit of turbulence. We shall tame these wild skies yet. <sighs> this feels like more than turbulence. Uh, for the record, that was not part of the planned aerial experience. What is that? Uh, yeah, I think our tether just came undone. Like <laughs> That's just a small setback. Nothing to worry about. I can fix this. I can fix it. I can grind these baskets, and it's gonna hit us. to him. No! Ah! No! Gotta follow his voice. Oh, I'm stuck on the other side. I've gotta clear out these machines. Doesn't look like plasma would do much damage. 